does Made in America really matter? Now, I'm not going to go into you know, copyright infringement or any kind of stealing because you know, I've known that to happen in America with new products as well. You know, they've been ripped off under the person's nose and you know, they've been none the wiser. So you know, it matters in a number of different reasons when the pen hits the paper and you're starting to calculate liabilities versus rewards. So when you're looking at bringing a product in from overseas, a lot of the times you have some liabilities attached to that. You have sitting at the dock, you have uh, customs, you have um, you know, increased liabilities as far as you know, the product leaving their country and the cost of shipping. So during the pandemic, we saw the prices go from you know, four or $5,000 for a container up to 20 plus for a container. So you, know, you don't have full control over those aspects. Whereas, you know, made in America, at the end of the day, you can buy a truck and you can ship, you can go drive it over there for less cost than it might take the ship from China. So uh, reduced cost of deliveries is a big aspect um, as far as the pro side of made in America. You also have shorter lead times. So if you're working with a product that's manufactured here, you may not have to deal with the lead times that could be associated with bringing the product in from overseas. And if it's a heavier product, you know, you're going to be on a boat. So, you know, that's 30, 60 days as opposed to, you know, having the product manufactured and then shipped, which could be five days. So you have shorter lead times. Um, it's also a little bit more environmentally friendly because it depends on where you meet being made in the, in the world, you know, we have pretty strict environmental um, regulations. So at the end of the day, the earth is a little bit happier sometimes when it's made in America versus being made in a developing country. Lastly, you have a higher standard of customer service. So you know, you're able to go visit the manufacturer within a day's notice as opposed to getting a visa, traveling across the world, and um, you know, having to arrange that with the manufacturer. You know, you can fly out from New York to California within a day. It's not as much of a problem when you need to put that oversight in. And oversight is essential when managing your business, especially when you're not manufacturing the product. So Made in America comes with a lot of pros, uh, some cons as far as higher cost, but at the end of the day, your cost is outweighing your liabilities often. So consider that when being made in America versus not, look at the pros and cons, look at the liabilities versus the non, and make a decision for yourself, of course, but made in America oftentimes can be better.